Alabama City is losing a service that's critical in transporting injured patients to hospitals. Tuscaloosa's only air medical transport service is now grounded because there isn't enough money to keep flying. CBS 42 News reporter Tim Reed has reaction tonight for what this means for critical care in West Alabama. Officials with North Star EMS tell us they were not flying enough patients per month to cover the expenses to operate a helicopter. North Flight has operated from the Tuscaloosa Airport for the last four and a half years. But three months ago, they were told their services were no longer needed. Uh, that's kind of the situation that happened. Uh, we, we were flying patients. We just weren't flying enough patients a month to cover the cost of the operation of the helicopter. North Flight's provider decided to cancel their contract with North Star EMS services. The helicopter service was too expensive, and medics weren't flying enough patients to cover operating costs. But North Star will still continue using ground ambulance services in Tuscaloosa County. The loss of the aircraft or the loss of that ability to get patients to tertiary care quickly. Um, but, you know, again, we're going to continue to do everything we can possibly do to take care of all the patients here in Tuscaloosa. Despite losing the helicopter service, officials say folks in Tuscaloosa County should not worry. Excellent staff of critical care paramedics, dual trained paramedic RNs. Uh, critical care transport paramedics um, and EMTs from this area and, and many with 20 plus years experience in this profession. Most of the staff of 12 paramedics and nurses will be reassigned to other ground crews. In Tuscaloosa, Tim Reed, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.